All this month, get any smartphone 32 gig and under for 50% off regular price at Appalachian Wireless. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. While supplies last, two-year agreement required. Last week, 93rd District State Representative Chris Harris filed legislation seeking to force the Kentucky Public Service Commission to look into the staggering electricity rates many ratepayers across the region and the state are enduring. The filings, House Bill 455 and House Resolution 109, both co-sponsored by Democrats and Republicans, would force the PSC to re-examine electricity rates and reconsider rate increases granted to utility companies, including Kentucky Power. The goal, Harris said, is to hopefully bring some relief to ratepayers receiving monthly bills totaling in the high hundreds and even thousands of dollars. These rates are insane and they're unconscionable. And not just the rates, but the riders that are also attached to them. And people, you see them on your bill when you uh, when you get your bill every month. Um, people just can't afford it. The House bill and the resolution basically provide a vehicle by which the Kentucky Public Service Commission can go back and reopen the case against Kentucky Power or establish a new case against Kentucky Power to re-examine the rate increases that they have received over the last 10 years. Kentucky Power has received two sizable rate increases granted by the PSC over the past 11 years. One of those centered around the acquisition of a generating plant in Moundsville, West Virginia to replace one of the older generating units at the Big Sandy plant near Louisa. Harris said a similar case in Virginia was rejected by that state's Public Service Commission. He hopes more scrutiny will be given to Kentucky Power's actions here. It's not like we're asking for something extraordinary. We're asking for them to take a look at the case again uh, in light of the downturn in the coal economy, in light of the profits that have been realized as a result of uh, what has been done. Uh, then I think it's more than reasonable to ask the Public Service Commission to take another look at these rates and see if we can get any relief for our, for our people. Harris said he has high hopes for the legislation filed last week. He's urging ratepayers to contact their legislators and encourage them to move the legislation forward. Reporting for EKB News, I'm Chris Anderson.